I'm back tonight with this beautiful game. Play it, uh, progress a lot, I hope. I was having computer problems. Uh, not sure what was going on with it. The USB was like, the devices weren't being recognized. I wasn't going to stream again, but I wanted to because I, I enjoyed hey. stream. Well, there's a problem right there. Uh, speak of the devil. I don't know what's going on with my USB. It's, it's the USB I use for my capture card is old, so that's probably why. I don't know if I, I think I have a replacement somewhere, but I don't know where. I'll probably fix it next stream. Hopefully it's not too much of a problem tonight. Because it hasn't been a problem at all. But I I guess I pulled my mic cord too, too uh, long. And it like disconnected me from the computer. Like it, the, it, the USB, the whole USB uh, thing in the back of my computer like just gave up. Uh... So that wasn't good. Hey, how's it going, 16th puppet? <laughs> it's giving root behavior? Uh, a little bit. A little bit. I'm trying to find my headphones. I don't even know where I put them. <laughs> oh, I just streamed earlier. I don't know where I put my headphones. I don't see it. Oh, here they are. I'm a little tired. I just woke up from a nap. And it's hot. Why is it so hot? It was it was cool like majority of the day. And now it's hot. My gameplay will, will decide if I get this. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. The gameplay is really good. I enjoy the gameplay and the, the characters and everything that's going on in this game. I'm about ha I'm like more... I, I think I'm about halfway. Pretty sure I'm halfway. So I don't want to spoil, spoil you on anything about what's going on. There will be spoilers. We're approaching Buick Bridge. Though I doubt the Empire would let us cross over to Rosalith. The regular chocobos aren't aggro, but the blue one is. I don't really want to kill them. I've been killing them. Killing so many chocobos. I don't like killing chocobos. Some people are split with this game. Any pro, pros and cons? Uh, the only con that I feel is the, like, it's visually. Uh, the motion blur in this game is, if it hurts my eyes to, to look at sometimes. Like, when I'm running around like this. I'm not moving the camera like this all the time. But when I am, like, it's very blurry. And then my eyes are, like, constantly trying to adjust. I have good eyesight, but... My eyes are like constantly blurry because of the screen is blurry and there's no option to turn off motion blur currently. There will be later, but that's it. And the frame rate, if you don't, if you don't mind frame rate, like dips, like this game isn't fully 60 frames, so it's not a smooth experience, but it is still like a good experience. Like I don't have a problem with the frame rate really. 
is more the motion blur, but that's about it. Gameplay is is fantastic, especially if you like pressing a lot of buttons and dodging. Like it's very fast, it's very good. And story and characters you'll get hooked on for sure because these characters are really really uh, good and they talk really well. Like they their character their their voice actors do a good job. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of people have been complaining about I don't know, just the randomest stuff. Like I, some stuff that that isn't even anything to complain about, honestly. People just like to complain about stuff. Um, your button mash. Yeah, I like to press buttons too, but like you can't just mash because you you uh, people like. When you hit certain enemies, they're not gonna care about you attacking them. So they're just gonna attack you. So you gotta you gotta make sure you dodge and stuff. The Empire would have us live in the Deadlands. At least that's on like action focused difficulty. There's action focused and and story focused. The story focus I'm sure is easier. <clears throat> the Empire has seen fit to banish us from And this our game was land. made to make to play multiple times, so uh the story is I think like forty or fifty hours or something like that. I'm not sure how long I've been playing. Um Because I got this a day early. Don't go thinking you'll find refuge in the houses outside Port Isolde. The place is a wretched hive of thieves and blackguards. And I like do and I like doing everything in the game. So I've been everywhere, every little inch of uh, of every area that I've been to, I've covered. I haven't left out one single area. And the game is very flashy, like, there's a lot of flashy combos, flashy looking elements. Like, all of your fire ele uh, elemental magic is really nice looking. Get him. The music is also very loud, so I try not to talk during the battles. This is really loud. At least to me it is. I think on stream it comes out loud too. Yeah, it is. It's really cool. It's very. Uh, the combat is very satisfying. Like really satisfying. It's really good. All yours, Toggle. When am I gonna summon? Uh, you can't uh, currently. Uh, you can't summon like like regular Final Fantasy games. You have to like it's story. The el the the icons, the summons are story based though, so, uh, and you can only turn into Ifrit as far as I know. I don't know if you can turn into the other ones because you have their powers, but you can't can you can't turn into them. Only Ifrit. So only the fights that are story related that you have to use Ifrit for, that's when you can do it. But I could be mistaken, you could probably do it later, I'm not sure. I don't know myself. Get him. Final Fantasy 15, that one, uh, you can like summon all of them that you get. So in Final Fantasy 15, when you get the, your summons, 
uh, you can just summon. Well, they randomly show up in, in, in random fights. Like, sometimes they don't show up, sometimes they do. And that you can summon in that game. The Lazarus. So, this one isn't like that. What happened to this place? My mother happened. The nobles who lived here didn't stand a chance. Let's hope my uncle fared better. And this area, I mean, this game has big areas. Like, it's not open world, but the areas are really big. There's a lot of the same types of enemies, though. So not many, not much in, enemy variety. Yeah, in the battle, you, like what you do instead of summoning, uh, when, instead of having summons, is you use their powers. So you have the abilities of Phoenix, Ramu, and Garuda, and you can just use their their abilities in the battle. You can't turn into them. Turn the game down a little bit just in case it was too loud it might just be me because i'm i'm i have mine a little loud on my headphones that's the main gate and it looks like we're not the only ones hoping to get in I can't go into this town yet. It's blocked or it's locked. I don't want to spoil it. I was gonna, I was gonna say you you can ride on chocobos too. Uh, I just got mine not that long ago, uh, but I don't want to ride on them right now. This is a spoiler. And see what that gets us. And they're pretty fast, like they're, you can get around with them faster than running. Let us pass. This game also has a lot of cutscenes, so, like a lot, but the, it's a Final Fantasy game. Every Final Fantasy game has a lot of cutscenes, a lot of dialogue. I love it. Those crystals belong to us all. I said, where were you, filth? Back to your stall. Cut you down where you stand. Just try it. No chance of slipping through unnoticed. We'll need to find another way in. I haven't looked up the lore in a while. Black shields. Spikes Regency. Nothing new. I haven't seen already. I thought we might be able to reason with the gods. Or at least bribe them. I suspect everyone in that crowd thought the same. Was that the only way in? Officially, yes. Strictly speaking, no. My uncle once told me that the nobles had tunnels built so that they could visit town without having to walk amongst the rabble. 
for Lazarus. We'll find our way into the city there. If you're sure. And the entire place looked abandoned. Do you think it's safe? As long as it is abandoned. Black light burns. The good news is we haven't seen a single black shield since Old Hill. Maybe they found who they were looking for. Stop, Torgal. You were right, boy. I think Torgal leveled up too not that long ago. He leveled up to Snowcloak. So he's at level 5 now out of 10. When the blight came to our village, we had no choice but to flee. But it seems the nobles of Port Isolde have no sympathy with our lot, and would rather we starved out here. to the camp. If so, I'd suggest finding somewhere close by to lay your bedroom. Those who rest their heads too far from the gates have a habit of getting set upon by bandits in their sleep. Open the damn gates! Please. We're so cold. Where are our crystals? the guards of that gate of Rosarian. They've sold their souls for the promise of a warm bed. Not that okay. I can blame okay. them. The Empire's left us nothing. I haven't done much. Just been uh, listening to people talk about what's going on in the game. We numbered six when we left our village. Two died on the road. Another passed just last night. I worry I might be next. Our last crystal just shattered. What are we gonna do now? Drink rainwater from puddles? Eat our rabbit raw? Jump over the barricade. <laughs> I can't. You can't jump that high. Look. <laughs> you can't jump that high. I have to go around. We have to go through this area now. That was blocked off. I always find it weird how in some games like like Final Fantasies, like you can fight things that are like 20 times bigger than you, and then like this, you can jump like this high, but you can't fly, like you can't jump that high, like over stuff. I guess you don't have, they don't have leg strength compared to arm strength, I guess. I mean, I could kill all those soldiers, but. That's not what the game wants me to do. This is nothing like I remember it. How quickly a crown can lose its luster. I think I have to go up there, so I'm gonna go over here first. Everything is Oh! Never mind, I have to go over here. He's able to wield all the Marvel powers, but not about can't do a there. mega jump. <laughs> He jumps like he has arthritis. Apologies. We'll show ourselves <laughs> out. What do these guys think they're about to do? I guess they don't know who we are. They got like dingy swords. Not. 
like look at our gear compared to theirs. Like what do they think they're about to do? Ow. Mistress, oh, I heard your Bridgetown dress. <laughs> yeah, she has is 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 middle is medieval, so like they are wearing like I've only ever seen medieval one man fight like that. clothing, and he's long dead. Then perhaps it's time you medieval high him. fantasy. Oh, that's <gasps> It can't <gasps> be. I Wait, I thought he died. This is a character from the beginning of the game. This is also a spoiler. I just found out about this right now. Oh my gosh. Forgive me, my lord. I knew not whom I addressed. You have naught to fear from us. Sorry for killing all your men. I knew he was alive. They didn't show a few people die, so... They just... They were just seemingly dead for like half the game. Aww, this is nice. <laughs> we go out on our first mission with him and another guy. We can speak inside. Oh, that's nice. I knew he was alive. They show him. They showed him get burnt in the beginning of the game, but. Um, I wasn't sure if he actually died or not. And those who wouldn't bend the knee? We left before the Empire could make examples of us. Teenage angst means me to go far. Yeah, his, <laughs> and we his gear is pretty to cool. Form the Guardians of the Flame soon after. Alas, there is only so much a handful of aging shields can do against the might the story of, the of this Empire. game was very very influential from but game of thrones to it, that their stay has it took a lot of inspiration from pleasant. game of thrones of late though at least very early in the game full just trying to keep the duchy's few remaining bearers out of the imperial's clutches the cullings we saw what happened in old hill why the foul work of the black shields and their mistress You mean my mother, but it doesn't make sense, even knowing what I know about her. Yeah, that's Game of Thrones. Her hatred for bearers was no secret, but she would Our mother is very Cersei-like. If you've seen the show, she's very Cersei-like. No offense, my very. lord, but in case you haven't noticed, the Lady Annabella couldn't care less about the realm. She barely even cares for her own home. That much has been plain since the slaughter at Eastpool. And since granting the Holy Emperor a new heir, her obsession with bearers only seems to have grown. As to why, I don't know. Maybe she can't bear the thought of anyone having the power to challenge her beloved son. Her son. So Wade, the Black Shields are broken camp. They march in full force for Buick Bridge. Then so do we. Make ready. Sorry for killing like 20 of your guys. This is their main host. If we remove the head, perhaps... Perhaps we can prevent what happened at the docks from happening somewhere else. If I do nothing, then the blood of their next victims will be on my hands.
Yours and ours. We too have witnessed the crimes these men who dare call themselves shields have committed in my mother's name. It cannot be allowed to continue. We must put a Waiting stop for the, to Oh, there's plenty of dragons. Smaller, smaller dragons. We must. So let us go with you. For the good. I fought one big there. one already. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Very well. If that is your wish, I would be honored to serve at your side. And we at yours. So, Wade, let us do our duty. With pleasure, my lord. Okay. There was another guy that, that was with him. Tyler, but we don't know where he is. And let's hope Sir Wade has a good quartermaster. Oh, that might be him, actually. I suppose we owe you our thanks. You spared us when you could have just as easily sent us to the mud. When you meet the mother of the dragons? <laughs> uh, I don't think there is a, uh, there's not a, a like, what's her name? There's not a Daenerys in this game type of character. Our mother is basically like Cersei. There's other characters that are similar, but not like, not like crazy similar. Desert Rose. This is a callback to Final Fantasy 2, I think. Of course, my lord. I just buy a bunch of this. I don't. I don't really know what for yet, but I'll buy a bunch of that. It has been an honor. We'll show them as much mercy as they did our sisters and brothers. You need Daenerys. <laughs> uh, I don't. Yeah. N well, they, there is a guy who's probably based on Daenerys, but we haven't we haven't got to him yet. He's a uh, king. Well, he's the the dominant of of bah Bahamut, which is uh, the dragon Bahamut. Uh, we saw him. Well, he was in the game earlier, Tell us then, but he so hasn't I... been seen in a while. What is your plan? Nothing but he turns into a Bahamut, a you, dragon. Lady but... Jill and I make for Buett Bridge, and provoke the main host at their encampment, sensing an opportunity to end the Guardians. The Black Shields will call for reinforcements, who will be met from the rear by parties of my brothers hidden throughout the surrounding hills. This will allow us to wage battle on the bridge without fear of being overwhelmed. While the Black Shields have an advantage in numbers, you see, they prefer to fight in small units, which we can use to our advantage. How small exactly? Small enough, now that I have you and Lady Jill for company. <laughs> I doubt I could have done this on my own. But until we arrived, that was your plan. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. So wait. The bearers from Old Ill have been laid to rest. Very good. Now make ready for battle. As you command. Thank you, Sir Wade. Perhaps now they will find peace. There is but one thing which will grant them peace. Putting an end to the Black Shields. And so we shall. Okay, party members. Throughout the main scenarios, Clive will often be joined by various companions who are keen to lend their assistance. However, depending on Clive's destination, they meet they may choose to remain behind at the hideaway. Oh, okay. Makes sense. So is Wade with us? Oh, he is. Oh, he's a guest. That has not happened yet. This is the first time that's happened. 
but we'll see how things go. See if Wade survives. May the blessing of the Phoenix go with you. Why isn't the gate already open? How long have you been pursuing the Black Shields? <laughs> Since they burned their first village. We tracked down the bastards responsible and fed their corpses to Stillwind. Suffice to say, that got their attention. It's been a game of cat and mouse. Surprisingly, well, okay. I would say that surprisingly, like the armies, there's there's a bunch of armies, there's a bunch of like problems that's going on. It's sort of Game of Thrones, like like there's kingdoms fighting each other and stuff for uh for rule. And but none of them use like 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 uh dragons and and uh plant like these plant monsters like none of them use that it's all humans it's all humans doing the battling and doing the fighting which i'm one well, they use chocobos because chocobos are basically the horses of final fantasy but they don't really use them to battle they just use them in battle and they can't chocobos can fight but they're not like physical uh, uh, animals what is it now I told you we bear a message for Jeez, the man, people popping from the guardians of the flyer works that <laughs> you presume for no reason tell us that a pair of filthy vagabonds a woman and a dog could God Where's the witcher? The, might of the, black <laughs> the witcher is the main character. <laughs> then come. Basically. Die along with your flesh. The main character sounds just like Geralt from from The Witcher. For but I don't think For I don't think it's the same character, the voice actor as as Geralt. Your petty revolution ends here. On these our swords, we swear. <laughs> Ow. Oh, speaking of, never mind. Small dragon, but... The bigger enemies... Okay, hold on. The bigger enemies are the enemies that take the most damage, and you have to actually, like, like hurt, try to dodge their moves, so... It's very loud, so I paused it there. Uh-oh. Sephiroth. <laughs> Sephiroth is nowhere near this game. <laughs> all Final Fantasies take place in a different world, timeline, and all that. Why didn't he die? He has like no health left. Don't worry, thank you. Oh, thank <laughs> thanks. Uh oh, Dragoon. A noble stand, albeit a misguided one. In taking it, you have but proven. These guys are really fun to fight. That this land is in dire need of cleansing. Our mom is basically the head of these people that are attacking us. Oh, 
Oh, I'm about to die. Barry, Couldn't see what was going on. <laughs> uh oh, that's bad. Oh my! I'm all the way back here. In the flesh. We'll show them that the fire in our hearts is not our enemy. At least you're not dead. That's the first time this game's done that. Usually, it starts you off at the boss fight. I don't think that was the option. I don't, was there a chest up here? No. We'll keep them from the bridge. May the blessing of the Phoenix go with you. That was a mistake. I'm just gonna ride on a truck wall. Let's go. It's faster. Yeah, you have to really pay attention to your health. I was trying to to out. To not use too many healing. I can't be Come along now. But that was my own fault. The bastard. Skipping. Your petty revolution ends here. On these our swords, we swear. All oh, your trouble, this one. This is basically Final Fantasy and the Fantastic Beasts. A little bit. A little bit. Oh, I can't skip this. A noble stand. Albeit a misguided one. Let me make sure I don't die this time. In taking it, you have but proven our point. That this land is in dire need of cleansing. Get him! 
enough to keep them occupied. We need to finish this. You mean finish him? Ow. Yeah, blown back. I don't know what's going on. Alright. That should have happened last time. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, battles can get very insane. Imperial Link. I think I've had a few of these already. I don't see any more. <sighs> Nor do I. The plan worked. It did. It bloody worked. We sent every last one of the rotten bastards straight to the mud. My, uh, Lord, perhaps this will be enough to stop the Cullings. For the time being, at least. Sir Wade. Guardians of the Flame. This is our mom, Annabella Lesage. She's very evil. Perhaps. Though I doubt my mother will she take did not love us at all. She'll move swiftly to see her minions ranks replenished. And then it will all begin again. She treated us like garbage our whole life. I often wonder if the nation we once knew is gone for good. Her fields rot. Her people starve. We battle to preserve the flame that was, but for every foe we fell, another springs up in its place. Yet be that as it may. It is still our home, and we must fight for it, as we always have, and always will. For as long as the Firebird's flame burns in our hearts, the Duchy cannot die, and her loyal subjects may dream of a day when the Rosarian standard flies over Rosalith once more. So why die? She sleeps Think with the army and calls it a day. Ah, uh, somewhat like that. Some, something like that. Strategy, my lord. She's a. Uh, she betrayed her husband. Got her husband killed. Almost got us killed and her. So she had two children. Us, five, and Joshua, our brother. And she nearly got all three of us killed. I don't really know why yet. We don't really know why yet. We haven't seen her since the beginning of the game. Uh, but she always, she always gave Cla uh, our the main character, the not even a cold shoulder, but like like he wasn't even, like he didn't even exist to her, because he was not able to, uh, be a dominant. Like he was not able to, uh, summon, uh, the Phoenix or Ifrit. Well, mostly the Phoenix. Ifrit was a, was a. Something that should not have happened. And how long has my uncle been funding you and your comrades' endeavors? Since the beginning. Lord Byron was the first person I turned to after forming the Guardians. And had I known of this tunnel back then, I wouldn't almost have been hanged by the city guard for trying to sneak over the wall. I suppose a formal request for an audience would have appeared suspicious. And appearances must be maintained. Were the Vice Regency to catch wind of Lord Byron's involvement in our movement, they'd seize his estate and send him to the gallows, where he would be of no use to anyone. And so, though it sickens him to the soul, he plays the part of the loyal Lord, knowing that one wrong move might prove his downfall. It is why he remains ever vigilant. Don't be surprised if he refuses you an audience, especially since you're famously dead. Then I will have to think of a way to prove that I am neither wraith nor wrongdoer. I might have something which could help with the latter. It's the mark of the Guardians. 
Display it, and those who love Rosaria will know where your loyalties lie. Your burnt blade from Wade. I shall wear it with pride. Be sure that you do. I don't want my men attacking you again. Unless you deserve it. If only Sir Tyler could have been here Aww. to see you. Well, well, I guess Lord Tyler Tom. died. Thank you, Sir Wade. If there is ever anything you need. I know. Go on now, my lord. It's been, I think, 18 years since we've seen our mom. We haven't, we're not going to see her yet. I don't know when we'll see her again. We're going to see our uncle. Which I didn't even know he had an uncle. How accommodating. Do you really think they believe we are who we say we are? Not a chance. I'll be right back. I'm pausing it for a second. Right, I guess. My uncle believes we're imposters here to rob him. He means to string us up himself. Imagine my surprise when I was told my nephew had come to visit. Clive Rosfield died long ago. So who do you think I am? And for uttering his name here, you shall pay with your tongue. How does he not recognize us? Oh, maybe he does. You would mock me as well. It is I, Sir Crandall of Camelot, loyal servant to Her Serene Holiness, Saint Sybil the Unshard. Madu, thou vile sorcerer, for thy crimes against church and crown, I shall have thy head. Wow. Five is out, a little bit out of character. This makes sense. Doing something only his uncle would see. Curse the infectious flax wench. Even in death, must thou plague me still? Very well. I shall open the gates of hell Aww. that thou might see thy charge once more. Bravo, Uncle. You're still the finest Madu in the Twins. <laughs> Aww. Clive, my dear boy, it's really you. <laughs> you always were fond of that scene from the Saint of the Sanctuary. Never did let me play Sir Crandall. <laughs> I have a favor to ask, Uncle Byron. Rutherford, inform the kitchens. There'll be guests. We dine immediately. But, Uncle... You can't very well regale me with the tale of your miraculous preservation on an empty stomach. Go on, sit. Um. 
see that you use the good plates, Rutherford. I'm glad we're getting some feel-good moments. The mo majority of this game is very dark and very sad. <laughs> well, not majority. So some of it is. To one of her cullings, Look at these big old tigers. Since becoming Viserine, Annabella has been a constant thorn in Rosaria's side, but these atrocities are a new low. Something has changed. Quite what? I don't know, but the woman we knew is gone. And a monster sits in her place. A monster. For better or worse, I've been charged with governing this town, and thus must maintain the illusion of obedience. That's all I can do to aid Wade and his merry band of revolutionaries. So he's told us. You have risked much for Rosaria. Our nation will be forever in your debt. It has been twenty years, Clive. The nation your father and your forefathers fought to defend is no more. Perhaps it would be otherwise had I the courage of my brother. All right, if it's a ship you require, a ship you shall have. I have a galley in port but recently relieved of her cargo. She can be outfitted for the voyage in a matter of weeks. So you believe us, then? About everything? Believe you? Ha! Only a fool would believe even half of the things you claim. But until tonight, only a fool would have believed my nephew still lived. And besides, I have it on good authority that Clive is telling the truth. Whose authority? Oh, the Final Fantasy song. On your own, of course. You've always been a terrible liar. Is that true? It's not untrue. <laughs> Let's say no more about it, eh? It wouldn't do to linger on my nephew's greatest failing. I can't wait to listen to the soundtrack of this game. The one thing I cannot believe is all this about you being Sid. You were always such a good boy, but now you're quite the outlaw. Which, if I'm not mistaken, would make me an outlaw's uncle. <laughs> right then, who shall we pillage first? Rutherford, fetch me my cutlass. Hope there's not like an ambush. This will be fun. I'm always thinking somebody's about to get killed, or a town is about to get burnt, destroyed. Because that's happened plenty of times already. Over there. Go on. She's a fine ship, isn't she? Once outfitted, she'll bear us across the boiling sea to Drustinus in the space of three days. Something on your mind. Monsters. When I served the Iron Kingdom, I, I did so because I saw no other choice. Because once they learned that the Lash would not move me, they turned it on those who could. This is the beginning. Of the, that was the beginning of the game. And so I became their puppet. I let them pull my strings, telling myself it was not my hand that swung the sword, but another's. I removed myself from the truth so I wouldn't feel the pain it caused. And before I knew it, I no longer felt anything, anything at all. I had become. 
become a monster. Jill. I don't want to be a monster, Clive. Do you understand? I want to choose a different path, a better path. To live on my own terms. But before I can do that, I need to come to terms with my past. And when you do, I'll be standing there with you, just as you stood with me. Thank you, Clive. I must atone for my sins. Only then, when it's done, will the monster cease to be. Just promise me that you won't die with it. Now, let's get some sleep. The journey back to Benamir is long, and there is much to tell the others. I have certainly knows how to ruin a moment. I, we have not seen them kiss yet. And they've had very close close calls with it. They're just... They just don't. Alright. I keep forgetting that fast travel is so fast. Only the founder knows what awaits us in the Iron Kingdom. But Vivian could probably make an educated guess. It will be over soon. One way or another. This is our hub hub area. This is our like quest giving, quest taking and and all that. How did we never hear new bullets, bullets being posted time. every day? Same way Not enough. Clive! Oh, am I glad to see you? Is something wrong? It's Blackthorn. He ain't himself. And if I'm honest, he ain't been for a while. But normally it only takes a couple of drinks to perk him back up, but not this time. Something's getting him down. And whatever it is, he ain't telling. It's like he's lost his spark, you know? He's barely got enough fire in his belly to get the ump about stuff. But I'm thinking he might if we both bent his ear, because he respects you, innit? So, what'd you say? Fine. If you think it will help. I knew you'd understand. But if he doesn't want to talk, we let him be. We'll open up when he's ready. All right. Now, he'll only smell a rat if we both turn up at once. So, I'll go first, and you can meet us at the forge. Wait a bit, then head over when you're ready. How may I help you today, Clive? Your benefactors are a generous lot. talk. Such is the renown of Sid the Outlaw that much of my clientele would rather spend their time pretting, pretzeling on about your endeavors than making any endeavors on their, of their own. For that, I owe you at least a portion of my earnings. For a particularly enamored sword left this on the nightstand. May it serve you better than it did him. Here you are. Come again. I may have more for you. A berserker ring? I don't remember what that does. Temporarily increases attack proficiency with each precision dodge. Sounds pretty good, actually. Uh, the Berserkers of Southern, Southern Ash. So, temporarily increases attack potency, proficiency, not potency. Attack proficiency with each precision dodge. That could be really good. Because I do dodge a lot. I like these two. This one I can get rid of. I'll put that on.
Nectar the Moogle. There's these hunts, but I can't. I had to go and actually find these monsters, which I'll probably do soon. Fairview, Sandbrick, the Broken Hilt, Rosaria. Or unless I can't do these yet. So Sandbrick and Rosaria. And I don't. I don't believe. Fairview. Oops. Let me see. Fairview, the Broken Hilt. Oh, okay. So I, it doesn't show it on the map. Let me see. Broken Hill. I think it might be like here or something. I can't put like a, I can't put a marker on it. So I can go here to kill one. And then Fairview. Fairview is over here. Right here. Okay. A part of me thought Drake's head might be the last crystal we ever cracked. But I'm glad I was wrong. People uh, popping fireworks. Potter's dragon. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to go kill those uh, things in a minute. I'm gonna accept these quests first before I leave here. I didn't take you for a scholarly van. Oh, this? It's Valisthea, a culinary pilgrimage. I borrowed it from old tomes. Seems there's no creature in the realm so foul it can't be cooked up into something yep. delicious. <laughs> Think I'll stick to the unfoul ones, thanks. Oh, How's it going, Grim? Adventure, Honestly, I've been all right. One How you been? One glance at these recipes, and even you would trade in your sword for a butcher's cleaver. From spit roasts to sweetmeats, this book Never has mind. them all. <sighs> what I wouldn't give to bring these recipes <clears> to <throat> life. If it's my blessing you're hoping for, then by all means. Well, I'm no <laughs> hunter, Sid. The first ton of worm I came across would be the Yeah, that's how me. that's how it be. But you're made of stern. I've been stuff. on vacation this week, so I haven't. Would you help me resurrect I've one of been these recipes? Playing this so much. Something tells me you won't be taking no for an answer. Fine. I'll help. Fantastic! Thank you. So dare I ask what's on the menu? Uh, chances stew. It was it's great. I'm having a I'm having a fantastic time, honestly. Though Molly's never heard of it. I'm 100 percent in the game, so I'm doing every side quest and all that. Extremely detailed in most respects. It's infuriatingly cryptic as to the main ingredient. A beast, no doubt. Most likely something that would make easy work of a simple cook with more broth than brawn, but unwanted violets. Nah, no I don't think I'm anywhere near done yet. Does the book say anything else? Maybe about halfway. Only that the I can't really violets tell. Sprout atop the bed of roses. Roses. Rosaria, perhaps? One of the butchers in Martha's Rest might know something. I'll ask next time I'm there. Nothing but unwanted violets will do if I'm to resurrect this stew. As to what they might be, as you say, that is a question for a butcher. <clears throat> that monster's taken quite a liking to Lady Karen. He's not a monster. He's Targle. And he takes you don't have like PS5 yet. If you gave him as many yeah, as uh... The, PS, the PC release might be a, a way off. Because they Square Enix designed this game specifically for PS5, so 
it might be a while, maybe like a year or two at minimum. First August. But it'll eventually go to oh, PC, you, most likely. What you pair up to? What's it got to do with me? August was worried that something had been weighing on your mind. I thought you might want to talk about it. <laughs> Did you now? I told you not to stick your nose in my business. Uh oh. Would you go and do? Clive just wants to help, innit? What's so bad about that? Talk to him. You never know, you might feel better for getting it all out in the open. Please, mate. I'm worried about you. Phil shut you up. It's nothing really. Stupid. Not the sort of thing you bother people about. Why don't you tell us all the same? Karen and I have an arrangement. I keep an eye on Goots, and she shows me what the competition's up to. Interesting arms and armor, things like that. Anyway, the other day, she shows me a cuirass she's come by. Masterpiece of level work. Light, supple, and tougher than it had any right to be. <sighs> Made my stuff look like every clumsy mm. shit. I should have brought the bastard thing there and then just to study it, but I was too proud. Now, every time I reach for my armor, I'm reminded that I'm not the craftsman That's I thought sad. I was. Yeah, you happy? You got what you came for. Now, piss off. All right, we're going. Yeah, I'm at a part of the game where it's pretty spoilery, uh, considering a lot of things that happen in the game up to this point. I always thought of old Blackthorn as a bit of a force of nature. Like a storm cloud full of ale. Didn't think anything could rattle him. Least of all a stupid piece of leather. Blackthorn's always taken pride in his craft. Questioning it means questioning himself. Something tells me this is only going to get worse. If he has doubts, it will affect his work. Which will only add to his problems. We need to nip this in the bud. I couldn't agree more. He said he should have bought that cuirass. Perhaps we should track it down for him. Assuming you're happy to help, that is. Too bloody right I am. Glad to hear it. First things first, then. We need to speak to Karen. So the side quests in this game differentiate. So the ones that have the plus sign are the ones that you get permanent upgrades for. And the regular side quests are just regular side quests that you you get little so, rewards from. Find a cuirass, give it to Blackthorn, then he works out how to make it and goes back to being his surly old self, right? Simple. Karen. But the ones with the plus don't pop up until this part of the game. Blackthorn mentioned is like halfway. recently come by a leather cuirass. An exquisite example of the craft, from what he told us. And he ain't been himself since he saw it. So we thought we'd buy it for him. Sorry, sold it already. Didn't think Blackthorn cared for it the way he turned his nose up. But it was nicely put together, that's for certain. Even if the bloke who made it is a bit of an odd one. Happened across him on my travels. Makes all his stuff to order, but the fella who commissioned it refused to pay. He didn't like the colour of some it. So I took it off his hands for a fair price. You don't know where we might find him, do you? Like I said, he's a bit of an odd one. Doesn't even have a workshop. He don't trust hunters neither, which means he spends as much time out tracking beasties as he does working the rides. I see. He did tell me something though. Apparently, his next commission's for a set of griffin hide greaves. Here, there's a griffin on the hunt Is there? board. The curse breakers were placing bets on who'd bag it. Now where the bleeding hell was excited? Somewhere in Sambrek, maybe. Cairn Northern. That was it. Thank you, Karen. A griffin. We'd be lost hmm. without you. At least you admit it. So, it sounds like going after that griffin might be the best chance we have of finding our roaming leather worker. I'll leave the hunting to you if you don't mind. While you get on with that, I'll ask around the markets. See if I can't sniff out who he is and where he's hiding. Good idea. Hopefully one of us will be able to track him down. If that level worker's even after the craftsman Blackthorn says someone's bound to have heard of him. 
I'll do a bit of poking around. See if I can't find something out. Good luck in Sambrek. Well, don't just stand there gawping. I thought he was done talking. If you're gonna buy some, be quick about it. It'd better all be here. You're rubbing me blind, you know. You'll not find a better price than that. I really don't have that much money at all. Deadlands wouldn't be half as bad without all the bloody dust. An apple a day. Lad from the yard ran up a basket of martels just this morning. Sweet as honey. And crisp as the morning breeze they were. I told myself I was going to have one, but I reckon if no one else listens to old Otto, I don't have to either. You had let Nigel and his lot know they've done a fine job. But it was a time you'd catch none but Sid supping on these. What for their foul bite. But for him, it was never about the flavor, but about what they represented. Our ability to make it on our own and look at us now. So we'd be so proud. Wade. Flame none brighter. My Lord Marquess. I ask once again for you to forgive my men for your welcome back to at the Lazarus. But certainly you can understand that you were the last person any of us were expecting to see at our gates. In the short time since our reunion, you have shown yourself to be the self-same man I followed into still when those many years ago. A true bearer of your father's legacy. If you only if only Ty Sir Tyler, the Lord Commander, and all the others who were lost that night were able to still see us, still with us, were still with us to see how bright your flame now burns. To you and your cause, I hereby pledge the sword of the guardians, and I'm proud to stand alongside you once again. Aquine and the Dominion, the, the Dalmix and the Imperials are to stand off. They snarl at each other, fangs barred like slum curs, but neither wants to make the first move. It's almost as if they both realized what a stinking pile of chocobo they stepped in. Uh, if I were a man to lay wager, I put my copper on this conflict not playing out anytime so i shall keep you in mind uh, i shall keep you apprised yeah. For the most of the game, maybe about like 90% of it, Orgle has been at our side in battles and fights and stuff, which is nice. I really like Torgal. Dozmare? Dozmare? Wow. Air Norvent. So I have to go to Sandbrick for two of these. I'm gonna go fight this one first, Belfagor, the Broken Hill in Rosaria. Go here first. Go so here for one. Kara Norvent. Where's Kara Norvent at? Is that... Oh, that's the other area, I think. I'm gonna take on this beast first. Wherever it is. Over here! Look at him! Go, go! 
I got. I need to just keep remembering to use my ability points. Judgment bolt I got finally. Uh, it might be here. I'm not. Sh yep, there it is right there. Elphagor. What level is it? Level 30? The wild wyvern. Whoa! Ow. Ow. That's why I haven't used my limit break in a while. That's probably the most damage I've done so far. Ow. Harry, nice. That was a really good battle. It was two levels higher than me. Oh, there aren't any more of them. Good boy.
You were right, boy. Fetch! Alright, so I need to go here. Then I have to go to another area for the other two, uh, the other two things. Stay sharp. The other two hunts. How close am I to level up? Uh, uh, a little close, but not that close. Catch your eye. There you go. Thanks very much. I want to buy these musical metal melodies, but I don't have the money. <laughs> that all is it. Thank you for sticking with us. Those of us who are still here have to look after each other, don't we? Uh, a lot of them cost like 40,000, 20,000. If you got a gill, I got the goods. What can I do you for? Unwanted violets. If you have them. Though I'd gladly settle for learning what they are if you don't. <laughs> Boy, I haven't heard folk call them that since I was a lad. You're looking for scorpion tails. Unwanted violets is what folk used to call them back in the day. They turn a wicked purple when you boil them up. Hence the name. Used to chuck them in the pot when there weren't nothing else on offer. When there was a war on, that sort of thing. Thankfully, times aren't yet as hard as that. And even if they were, you wouldn't find anyone selling them these days. Do the scorpions still live nearby? I dare say they do. Three reeds would be your best bet. Memory serves. Thank you. You've been most helpful. Have to go, okay. Causing any trouble now. Let's go. Fly Ambrosia. There's a potion here. What in the world? So I'm I'm do every so often I uh I have the Pokemon home on my mobile on my phone and uh every so often i get a shiny it's my like second or third shiny surviper i just got on through wonder trade through the wonder box you can you can trade up to 10 pokemon every like few hours pretty good it's a pretty good feature i like it a lot and i keep all the pokemon that i don't have or or that are rare. Scorpions. At least I know what I'm up against. I like oh. that one so much. Enemies in this game do not have uh, weaknesses. Like, there's no enemies that are weak to elements. They're all pretty much the same. 
which is a little weird because bombs absorb fire and you can use fire on bombs. <laughs> I better get this back to Yvonne before it goes bad. <sighs> or any worse, at least. <laughs> I'm done in this area. Now I gotta go here. Have to go Care Norvent. Inside of Care Norvent, and I need to go here to clear view. Nice what was in Clarity? It was a, it was a, a certain monster, but I don't. It didn't have a. It didn't have a picture oh, of what on. the monster is I'm looking for. Fly Ambrosia. Is that it? Oh, oh it's the Garuda. That's what it is. Okay. Right over here. Probably one from Garuda. It's not a it's not Garuda, but it's a harpy. Thanks, girl. Aruna. Yeah. 
See what was going on. <laughs> it was still staggered until the end. How did I rest well? I know I will. Good boy. <laughs> Jill's helping a lot too. I can't pet her though. Not yet. I feel good, boy. <laughs> uh, Karen Norvent. Can I just fast travel with it? Just the gates. Wait, I can go here now. Let me see. Let me see something real quick. Good day to you. Can I interest you in today? I hope it's to your liking. Um, we are to dig a new cellar. So at the very beginning of the game, I tried to go over here and it was an invisible wall. Like the, it wasn't blocked off. It was just, I could not progress to like the back part of this area. So I'm gonna see if I can now. Uh, yep. Yeah, it was like block. It blocked me off from coming here. I don't know why. I think it was. It's supposed to be like a something. Probably a side quest. They're gonna. It's gonna happen here, or a hunt, or something story related. Probably. There wasn't much here. I have to go fight the griffin now. I don't have any health. I probably should have healed That's and bought more potions. Oh, I, I can't get in from that side, from this side. Oh my. Um, my, is this not where I have to go? Okay, Norvin is right here. And I can't, maybe it's not inside of Care Norvin? This isn't Care Norvin. It's like right here. Or is this Care Norvent? No, it's not. Let 
Let me see something. Maybe I have to accept it? I don't know. Let me get this side quest done while I'm here. Did you find our mystery ingredient? I did indeed. Marvelous! Let's see. <gasps> what am I supposed to do with this? It's poisonous, surely. You wouldn't be wrong. But that's your unwanted violet. Into the pot it goes, I suppose. Uh, wait here. What? I won't be long. I'm not about to eat this. Ew. Does not sound good at all. Ew. He's no Ignis. I present Chance's Stew, risen once again from the ashes of obscurity. Grab a spoon, Sid. Let's eat while it's hot. I'm not. <laughs> not hungry. Well, he's gonna... it'll be too late once I've licked the bowl clean. Ew. Your loss. He's gonna get sick and probably die. Oh. Mm. Uh-oh. <coughs> oh, Odin's teeth. What the salt on the senses. It's like choking on swamp <coughs> water. And, and yet, up through the pungency, there rise complex meaty notes it it takes a moment to recover from such an onslaught of flavors yeah, right. never have i tasted anything so fine thank you sid yeah right thank you you're welcome i must share this gift i won't rest until the steaming bowl of chance's stew sits before everyone in the hideaway a single mouthful and Molly will be breeding scorpions of her own. I'm sure she will. Yeah, this berserker ring is really good. It's probably the best <sighs> ring in the game. She's taken quite a liking to Lady Karen. And what can I do for you? Coin purse weighing you down. You'll not find a better price than that. Nectar. That was Dosmer. Yeah. Oh, Care Norvin Westgate. Oh, okay. It's not inside of the Care Norvin. Okay. Westgate. Westgate? I'm guessing it's here. Along here, probably. We'll see. Griffins don't exactly make for easy prey. Let's hope our craftsman hasn't bitten off more than he can chew. Tracking down a griffin, well... Killing a griffin is probably like not the best thing. Oh, it's here. I didn't... Oh, there it is. 
I did not expect this thing to be here.
dead. Ooh, Orgo got the last hit. <laughs> Man, that thing put up a big fight. Level up. Nice. Arlitite? Hardest metals known to man. One of the hardest metals known to man. Pretty nice. Too bad. It would have been cool to ride on this thing. The same Harry Potter. There's something there, boy. Oh, oh wow. Could that be our man? Are you all right? Yeah. Dare say I'll survive. That griffin caught me before I could get an arrow off. Must have lost sight of me in the grass, though. I'd be dead if it hadn't. More likely than not. The name's Camille. I'm a lowly leather worker, if you couldn't tell by the smell of me. Not so lowly from what I hear. Do you remember selling to a merchant by the name of Karen? <laughs> She's not an easy woman to forget. Bought a caress from me after I lost my buyer. Quite taken with my work, as far as I recall. Didn't stop her bartering me down to a pittance, though. <laughs> she sent you for a refund? It's not her who sent me. Well, consider me flattered. You should be. He's a master of his art. And not an easy man to impress. Blacksmiths are proud folk. It's a rare thing indeed for one to praise a glorified tanner. And I don't imagine an impressive swordsman like yourself would be getting your steel from any but the best. I'd dearly love to help a fellow craftsman, but... Well, actually... I suppose you could give him this. What is it? Treated leather. Same stuff I used to make that caress. If your man's as skilled as he sounds, he'll know what he's looking at. You sure? Well, you did save my life. And thanks to you, I'll be going home with all the griffin hide I can carry. I'd say it's the least I can do. Short of showing him how to make the thing myself. That is. But there are rules against it. Secrets of the trade and whatnot. In that case, I'll see that he gets it. I'd be much obliged if you would. Right. I've got some griefs to make. You send your blacksmith my regards. Will do. And thank you. Hopefully this will sweeten Blackthorn's mood. Nobody learned knows how to take pictures in this game. <laughs> Jill is like not even faced us. Oh, now she does. Now Torgo isn't. 
Come on, Torgo, look at me. This is my favorite music of this game, probably. I really like this overworld thing in this part of the game. Torgal? Okay, whatever. I got a picture, so... I don't know... I think you could probably buy the music. I don't even, like... I don't... I don't have the money for it, but... I don't know... What, what it's even called, where to even buy it. I wanted to play here, but I like this. I like this music too. And with a bit of luck, Clyde might even find the geezer. Bloody busybodies, the both of you. How'd it go, Clive? Did you find him, or does the hunt continue? I found him, and he asked me to give you this, along with his regards. said he wouldn't teach you how to work it, but that if you were as skilled as you sounded, you'd have no trouble understanding how it was done. Uh, so that's his secret. Crafty bastard. He's layered and cross-grained it. Good few times, too. No wonder it's tough. And that's no ordinary oil he's used to get that finish. Oh, this is fine work. Even finer than I thought. Yeah? I'll take your word for it. Just looks like leather to me. Still, I'm glad you're happy. Here, Clive. You didn't happen to catch the fella's name, did you? Camille, I believe. I thought as much. There ain't many leather workers in the realm daft enough to do their own hunting, see? And his name kept cropping up when I was asking around. Turns out, he's from Tabor. And again, most leather workers are. But our friend Camille guards a long-held family secret, the details of which are the subject of some debate in the leather-working community. Then we better keep this close to our chests. Listen, sorry for putting the both of you to all that trouble. Should have kept my moaning to myself. Still, I'm glad you found him. This has cheered me right up. That was the idea. Clive's idea, anyway. He did most of the work. It's good to have you back, Blackthorn. Just don't expect me to go turning out work like this. There's a reason he does his own hunting. He knows exactly what hides to look for. And that's how he gets them to layer up so nicely. And don't get me started on how much oiling this leather would need. But I reckon I can make something about as good. Something a curse breaker will have no trouble caring for. Anyway, enough narrowing. I've got work to be getting on with. Looks like we won't be needing a new blacksmith. As if there was a better one out there. Nah, it wouldn't have been the same anyway. No one spins a yarn like old Blackthorn in his cups. <laughs> right, now that's sorted. I've got duties to attend to. Thanks, Clive. You've given me my mate back. Blacksmith's booze. Blues, not booze. Drake Slayer built design design draft. Pretty cool. So it's not something. The recipe, so I had to have him make it for me. I wonder if it changes my design. I don't. Design drafts. You have obtained the design draft for the Drake Drake Slayer belt. Drake Slayer's belt. Design drafts unlock. New crafting options at the Black Hammer. What do you need? Sorry, what it be? No new sword. Drake Slayer belt. Electri Electrum? 
probably what is that icon that's much better than what I have yeah that goes up by a lot I don't have the uh, uh, one material and bracelet too gelatinous mask oh so I think those are uh flan is those flans little that little icon it's like a certain flan from Final Fantasy 13 who 13 but these you can't upgrade they're just really good and how am I meant to do that then? really good uh, armor like the purple weapons and armor you can't upgrade which sucks because they're like the best of like the sets but you can't upgrade them so you have to constantly get new gear Oh, maybe, maybe it's not. The gelatinous thing is most likely a flan. I haven't saved in a long time. Five hundred and sixty points. I really stopped using this. I, it's a really good move. Maybe I should put it back on. I don't know. It's really good though for multiple enemies. I might just save my points for a while. I think I'll save my points. I found another one of these. I found two of these Demon Tamer sashes. That's the first time I ever found like more than one item. Or more than one accessory or a uh, ear. For the most part, I only have one of each thing. How did we never hear about these guardians, guardians of the flame every day? Same way they never. Welcome to the patrons' whisper. Is everything we've received and everything promised? If I can get this empty shard. What is that? Eric's medallion, direwolf, Jess. Swelling chorus. It used to be it used to be I would step into a tavern only to find myself overwhelmed with requests to sing of Dion Dion the Bold or the or the or of or the curl and the serving girl. But now all anyone wants to hear is hear of is Sid the Outlaw. You have made me a very rich man, my friend. You earned this. I have 155 renown. Best of luck what did I just get? Seat. I got a song and an empty shard. A nondescript fragment of a crystal long spent. Most likely for something to upgrade something. Or that. Oh, I can sell it. There's some things that can be sold only I'm not sure like these goblin coins I could sell them but I don't think they're they can be used in in crafting I'm not sure I might have to look it up let me look it up because I'll just sell them all Everything's popping up for Final Fantasy 16. I mean, Final Fantasy 14. Is 
No, it was 16, not 15. Okay, so I guess certain items can only just like just only be sold and not have any other use. So I'll, I'll sell that stuff soon. Nothing else so far. I didn't want to, whoops. I wanted to listen to that, but I had to press X, not triangle. Is it business? Oh. So, they're all valuable. Oh, so it just sells it. Auto okay, I'll do that. Now I have a lot of money, oh my gosh. I wish I could hear which one these are. I don't I don't just want to buy them and not know what they are. Cannot find a better price than that. I'll buy both. You're rubbing me blind, you know. Um I'll, I'll sell a bunch of this stuff too. Like a couple hundred, if there are a few hundred. I reckon I can find a buyer. I have a lot of this. I'll probably sell like 400 of this. You got out else? Sell 300 of these. I'll be thankful you got that much. Yeah, some of the stuff you just get a lot of so it's good to sell it because you're not really using it for anything. I'm keeping all my accessories throughout the game. That's what I usually do. I usually don't sell my stuff. It better all be here. I don't really need elixirs right now. I'll buy all this stuff later on in the game. Oh, oh, okay. That's the song from the beginning of the game. I like that song too. This one's good, also. Did 
This game doesn't really reuse tracks, which is interesting. Did you come to borrow a book, Seed? Because you can't have them. How good it is to see you, Clive. I don't believe you've read this particular chapter before. What subject shall we consider today? How did I not level him up right there? It's like a little bit. Younger brother of the late Archduke Elwin. Everything you needed? My knowledge is yours. What subject shall we consider today? I like the bestiary. There will. Okay. This game has orcs, but we have not found any orcs yet. We might not, but they do exist. Have I really run into the majority of the enemies in this game already maybe of the wildlife because there's like soldiers and stuff that aren't on here or maybe there's like different types of like like orcs here's the orcs right here read through all that stuff eventually off stream most likely most likely after I beat the game or at a certain point Again, Lord Rosfield, I'm touched that you should find me such good company. <sighs> it is not your company, but your counsel that I seek on this occasion. <sighs> Ever the charmer. What will it be today, then? The Iron Kingdom. I need to know what to expect. You'll soon be setting sail for Drake's breath, then, I take it. The mother crystal that rises from the boiling sea. There was a time when a true-blooded Rosarian had only to brave the waves to visit it. But then the Ironblood made their move. I'm gonna put my controller on the charger. As you know, the Iron Kingdom rules over the islands to the west of Storm. Or rather, its church does. But this is not the pragmatic approach to state religion employed by the Holy Empire to manipulate the masses. No, the Iron Kingdom is the literal embodiment of the crystalline orthodoxy. And so, if one is to understand it, one must start there. As the name implies, the orthodoxy holds the Mother Crystal sacred. And they do not take kindly to heathens plundering the objects of their worship for the means to fill wash tubs and light lamps with frivolous feats of magic. Indeed, the faithful consider ether a sinful thing, a poison no less. And to them, a dominant is an instrument of evil, albeit one they have proven only too happy to turn against their enemies. Some 80 years ago in Northern Storm, Drake's eye collapsed. Soon after, in pursuit of Aether and with the Blight at their backs, the Northern Territories descended upon the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. And when the Shields of the Flame marched north to meet them, the Iron Kingdom spied an opportunity. A few short days later, the Crusaders landed on the island of Mount Justanus, home of Drake's breath, and plucked it from the Duchy's grasp. Rosaria tried to reclaim it, of course, but to no avail. 
I doubt more than a handful of duchy men have set foot on its shores in your lifetime. Nor are they like to again, under the Empire's stewardship, meaning the Iron Blood will keep their island, and with it, the foothold they need to march on mainland soil when next they spy an opportunity. The Mother Crystal is both the object of the Iron Blood's worship and their gateway to the continent, making Drustinus the holiest of holy grounds, from which the Orthodox Crusade shall one day sail forth to claim the remaining Mother Crystals, or die trying. My father and my grandfather both traded blows with the Iron Blood for control of Drek's breath. Had things unfolded differently at Phoenix Gate, we would have sent our entire fleet against them. But instead, they sent their fleet against Rosaria, sacked the capital, killed the men, and captured the women, including Jill. I'd say you'd be forgiven for wanting a little revenge, Clive. My only aim is to destroy the Mother Crystal, but... Thank you all the same. Not much else to do here. Let's see if Jill's ready. Here for another of my lectures. Study it well, Clive. Here's the latest information I have. Okay, so Tyler, it still says Tyler is alive, but Wade, Wade was there with him. So unless Tyler, I mean, unless Wade doesn't know Tyler is dead or alive, we don't know, I guess, yet. Our uncle. Benedicta was the, um, she was very much the Lady lady Dimitrescu of this game. She's in every single trailer, I'm pretty sure. But she's only in the game for like 20% of it, probably. Maybe not even that much. Like just the first like little chunk of the game, she's very involved in. Then after that, she's not really in it anymore because she died. But she's still important. Because she's the reason why uh, Hugo Kupka, the Titan dominant, is uh, after Odin. One way or another. Are you ready? I think so. Jill. When you told me you had to come to terms with your past, you weren't talking about destroying Drake's breath. <laughs> Wait. No. I spoke of Imran. The leader of the crystalline orthodox. The man who made me do all those unspeakable things. I'm going to kill him. It's what I need to do to put the past behind me. What I need... to move forward. And I know that I can do it. If you're there beside me. Always. And I'll be beside you, too. We'll bring down the Mother Crystal together. All while Sid looks on. We'll make him proud. All right, main mission area. Just jutting forth from the fiery maw of Mount of, of Sacred Mount Justinus, the Mother Crystal is the pillar upon the faith upon which the faith of a cloister nation rests. Alright, now we're taking it to Titan. I think this is where Titan is, or Hugo. 
maybe that's a different area. That's a very quiet ship. Useful trick. Freezing and thawing the spray to make mist. Hmm. How did you learn to use your powers like this? The Masters made me do it. When the Crusaders took to the seas. To keep the fleet's movements from prying eyes. Oh no. I'm fine. Oh no. No, He's... you're not. She's overusing her powers. Oh man. This may be the only chance I get to go back. My only chance to put things right. I have to do this. Whatever the cost. All right. I knew it. I knew she was going to be like in danger of becoming a uh, or of the curse the crystal's curse there she is the iron kingdom's mother crystal drake's breath Strong currents, sharp rocks, and ether floods. Let's not forget them. This island is a natural fortress. But safety breeds complacency. Allowing a single rowing boat to slip in unseen. The sanctuary is inside the mountain. If we follow the old trail, we should be able to enter by the back gate. All right. Let's go. Fire and ice. Very Game of Thronesy. I always imagined when I came here it would be to reclaim it. It used to belong to Rosaria, didn't it? Once, though it's been in the Ironblood's clutches for far too long. As was I. For 13 years, this rock was my home. I know its secrets only too well. This path was abandoned after an ether flood. They don't guard it anymore. The perfect little shortcut. Fun one in this game is really good, but you can't really do much with it. That's a pretty cool shot.
I saw someone complaining on Twitter. Oh my gosh, this sucks. I don't even want to bring it up, but someone's complaining about the the ledges. You you having a shimmy? You don't one. You don't shimmy in this game. You just run through ledges like this. And there's like there's only been like I can count them on one hand how many has been in the game so far. Music is really loud here. They're all Akashic. The ether flood must have spread. It was never as bad as this before. Then the only way past them is through them. <laughs> all the time that wasn't even a bad one it's nothing to worry about I think Square Enix said they put like they made like 200 plus tracks for this game. Slow. 
The old arboretum is just up there. We'll enter the caves from there. Breath of the Wind Aerial Blast? What, is, what move is that? Wait. Reduces Aerial Blast cooldown. What move is Aerial Blast? Oh. Oh, cooldown for that one, okay. For that super move. I'm not having a part time with cooldowns at all. Boss fight. Oh, look at this place. What a mess. Wait. Malboro or Marble. It's turned. Nothing is shielded for Zarya. I haven't fought these one of these since the beginning of the game. Just like old times. Worst breath. You sure to keep clear of this ball. Believe me, I need to. Don't breathe it in. Oh, what is Jill doing? He has like a shield or something.
man, this game is everything I wanted, man. Honestly. It's like the combat is just way too satisfying, man. Press on? Yes. Mount Drestinus. It's like a furnace in the air. That's the volcano. We're inside yeah. the volcano. You get used to the heat, though I don't remember it being quite this hot. I need regular potions. Was that one cause for concern? It was. And they're getting bigger. Something's wrong. There we go. Scarlet Scorpion. I'm not sure which way it is to go. Salamander. Sick of these people and their fireworks. Time to fight. Over here. Over here.
Is there no other way across? Uh oh, we'll see what happens here. This is our first time seeing her in this form. supposed to get out. Maybe there's another way out. I don't know. This is Mustafar? Mustafar? Bombs. They don't look too tough. Perhaps not alone. But in numbers like these... Yeah, bombs, they don't absorb heat or fire in this game. Almost really bad. I didn't know that bomb was gonna do explosion. Well, we aren't going this or self-destruct. Let's look for another path. That was actually almost game over. That was very close. Drake's breath. We're nearly at the oratory. Plan. What the hell Red moose. I have absolutely no idea. Well, whatever it is, I don't think it's friendly. Yeah, over here. What is that? Fireaga. Ow. 
I think I'm gonna try to parry that. Mithril wristlet. Finally, a new, new gear. After like I don't know how long, finally got some mithril stuff. <laughs> Looks like a boss area. Oh, another one of these things. the lava if i didn't know better i think this volcano was about to erupt why attack us then this one must be the exception oh my god okay this thing is about to mess me up again because of the timing of these attacks Sonic. I seem to remember I can do this. I keep forgetting about this. Probably do this at like the beginning. spamming attacks. Ooh. That's 
side. I didn't realize he was close to dying. <laughs> I thought he still had a chunk left. Gnarled scale. Thank you. Quite a commotion our friend made. Let's hope the guards didn't hear it. The gate to the inner chambers is just up there. Then we make for the sanctuary. I need to finish this. Before the heat finishes me. Hear, hear. We'll enter the Comric by the Handmaiden's living quarters. It was always a hive of activity. Sounds like we'll have a hard time staying out of sight. We won't have to. There's someone there I should very much like to see. How does, how does, uh, how does Tor Torgo, uh, come up the ladder? How does he climb up without, without help? I guess he could probably jump, but he's very special. Who would want to live in a volcano? Who would want to have, like, a Whatever this is in a volcano. Crazy. Whom is this? It's me, Python Buffer. Jill, it can't be. It is, my lady. We cannot talk here. Come with me. I'm so glad you're safe. And I, you. Why ever would you risk coming back? Are you a fool, girl? Or have you grown tired of your freedom already? Forgive me, my lady. But I had to come back. There are things I left undone. Tell me, where is the Patriarch? What is this, Yakuza? At this hour, he'll be in the Comric, giving thanks. You mean... Oh, thank fiend! Clive, we have to get to the Sanctuary. 
Now. Lady Marley, you must flee this place, gather your things and go. Now listen here, Jill. In Alak, no. We have company. <gasps> what is this, Xenoblade Chronicles 2? That sounded like uh, the guards in that game. <laughs> Probably the same guy's voice. This way. Follow this passage. It leads straight to the Comric. Go on, stop dawdling. Thank you. You were always so kind to me. My light Hurry up, Joe. You're gonna get her killed. Take care, my lady, please. You deserve better than this. A long and happy life, promise me. to do the same. Come on, Clive. We're nearly at the Comrec. All right. Hmm. Interesting music. The oratory. 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 Feels like Dark Souls. It's our welcoming party. I've had enough of their hospitality. Get him! Too slow. All yours, Not sure where I'm supposed to be going. I don't want to go through any doors yet. Okay. Oh, that's the crystal right there. How many of them are there? Too many. Get him. Nice try. All yours, Corporal. Over here. Go, 
guy was a very much of a pushover. I don't even think he touched me. <laughs> that was a crazy, uh, crazy fight. He didn't even damage me. I parried him twice, dodged all his moves. I just noticed our spell is Thundara, not Thundaga. I wonder why. Ow. What? Something I need you to know. I saw the Patriarch do things no one should have to see. And so I swore that he would die by my hand. I understand. I faced my demons, and you must face yours. Upgrade. I do this a lot. I use this a lot. Also use this a lot. But mastery doesn't really do much. Or maybe have I not upgraded this yet? Oh, I haven't upgraded it yet. Increases follow-up strike speed. Increased hits. Increases hits and ability radius. I want to use this one too, but I probably don't. I'll do this one. Oh no, not this one. Whoops. Uh, this one. This one widens area effect and increased pot increases potency. Or should I just switch back to this? I'm. I think I'm gonna switch back. To uh, rising flame. But 
I haven't used this in a very long time, but it's also really good. We're nearly there. Just one last push. I got splendid soul. This one. Ow. Oh, I thought I got hit. Race of the Inferno, that's for the Willow, Willow Wikes move that don't have any use that yet. This isn't the best place to hold this type of thing. Shiva's dominant. Come to beg forgiveness for your failure. For years I followed your orders. Fought your wars. All to protect the children you took. Just as you took me. And what did you do in return? Jill, we need you. You put them in chains and you slit their throats! Fiend. <laughs> their souls were sullied with a stain of ether. I merely cleansed them of their corruption. A penance paid, just as the Holy Mother wills it! Repent! 
abomination for a monster like you to set foot in the holy cumrich is in itself a crime deserving of death you're right i am a monster and my soul is stained black though not by ether but by the evil of men like you who made me close my heart and drown in darkness when I should have raged against it? This is my penance. I will be your monster no more. Nor will I suffer you to create another. <laughs> Does the beast bear its teeth at its master? Come then, Dominant. Rage. Be as you have ever been. A monster! And what are you, Imran? I was forced to kill. You do it by choice! But never again. I bowed to you once. Now it is you who shall bow to me! Kill them. Cutscene. <laughs> Now. 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 Right. Is that Joshua? I think. this not typhon I have a icon fight right here. Torgo, get somewhere. Go somewhere, please. Oh no. Why? Why can't I do it? I'm streaming this right now. Oh, never mind. Not a. Uh... She won't be able to hold that half back forever. Liquid flame. Oh, there he is. I'm just in my limit break. Get him. Uh, 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 
to go somewhere. Go. I don't want Torgo to get hurt. I won't take long. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize. 
<laughs> Not realize how close he was. Liquid flame. Two of them. So this is the second crystal, and the first one we fought Typho Typhon, and this one we fought Liquid Flame. I'm going to finish this, Clive. I think it's a good thing you cannot use Ifrit that often because overuse of the icons just seems to take too much of a toll in a bad way. And they overworked Jill. They overworked Jill for years. And here, use this. Hmm. Where's Joshua at? Oh, that's Final Fantasy thing. How did he survive? What did you do to it? Oh, we destroyed it. What? What? Monster? Monster? Do you have any idea what you have done? I do, Father. I have killed the monster! and become an outlaw. May the blessing of the crystals go with you. It's over. It is. And Shiva exacted her price. She did. Again, the burden fell to you. And I bore it willingly. This was a sin for which I had to atone. Now I can continue at your side with my head held high. I don't know if we're done here yet. Are we? Joshua was there somewhere. I think that was him. He had his hood on, but every time we've seen Joshua since he's unveiled himself, he's headed off, so I don't know who that was. Clive, look. It's just like the one in hmm. Phoenix Gate. Ultima? Maybe? Damn it. We need to leave. Agreed. Oh. I don't think that's Joshua. That might be somebody else. Or maybe it's us again. Maybe it's Clive again. Man, this game is beautiful. Like the effects. It's beautiful in general, but the effects are crazy. Oh, I kept my promise. 
so now you keep yours. Legacy. Now two mother, no, three mother crystals are left, I think. Yeah, there's Joshua right here. This way. Oh, Congress. no. Well, that's the girl, the medicine girl. You're bleeding. That's her name, still. I have a tonic which will. I thank you for your kindness, truly. But I assure you, I will survive. Please, save your medicines for those who need them most. Oh, well, if you're sure. For a moment there. Oh, his I his chest has the presence. purple from Ultima. You did. I fear he is in Ultima's thoughts again. But why now, after five years of silence? I forgot it's been five years since he did that. I cannot keep him sealed away much longer. Your grace. No, do not dirty your hands. Ah, oh, Joshua. Look at them all. Like a river flowing to the sea. Or moths to a flame, perhaps. The crystalline dominion, their light in the darkness. More and more lose their homes to the blight and set out in search of sanctuary, while others lose their fortunes to the Dalmechian levies and leave to find new livelihoods. What is it that you seek in the Dominion, Your Grace? Oh, the Unlassage. You mean the Crown Prince of San Breck? He has many titles. Dion the Bold. Prince of Dragoons, Odin's nemesis, or simply Bahamut. I met him once when we were children. He was a chivalrous soul even then, and has served his empire indefatigably ever since. And you are confident that he will listen to what you have to say? Our world lurches ever closer to the abyss. And a hidden hand ushers us onward. Ultima's influence extends to every nation, Sandbrek included. If His Highness is the man I believe him to be, and I pray that he is, this truth will not have escaped his notice. As the mother crystals fall, the eternal flame wavers, and the azure sky begins to bruise. How lucky we were to be blessed by the crystals, and yet how spoiled, like canaries in a gilded cage, growing fat on seed. But now, the bars are closing in, and we must take flight. Painful though it be to leave our home behind, it is what we must do to be free. Which is it that men cannot live without? A blessing that leads to damnation, or a freedom that leads to deprivation? I do not yet know the answer to that question. Do you, Clive? <coughs> Your Grace, let us find a place to rest a while. We can return by the Dalmechian Trail once you have recovered your strength. I realize your duty is pressing, but if your health should fail... I know. 
Thank you. Your turn. Is that her, the first time we see her, uh, hear of her name? Yote? <laughs> Who Hugo's place? Randella. Very Middle Eastern vibes here. The army's attempt to breach the Empire's defenses and gain the Isles of Ark has failed yet again. Only because your fleet has proved as impotent as a eunuch on uh. laying night. Would you rather we simply fell back to the capital? Enough, both of you. All here agree that the Empire cannot be allowed to maintain its illegal. I can't tell if these are like white people. However, or, or Middle Eastern people, but day. he looks Middle Eastern, sort of. He, uh, he also looks white. They all look like white, but they could be Middle Eastern too. I don't know. There is a literal sea twixt you and your prize. The armies of Sambrek need but sit back and watch as you harmlessly lap against their walls. They are dug in like ticks, and seek to draw out this siege, knowing the capital's stores are nigh bottomless. And what of our wise rulers? Goaded into war without any thought as to what chaos it might reap. Republican soldiers starve while waiting for orders from Randalar. You would but take the field, their bellies would be full by nightfall. If I take the field, so too will Bahamut, and our duel will shake the island to its foundations. Instead of liberating the Dominion, you would doom it to destruction. Unless that is what you desire. Uh, uh. If our learned advisor has a solution to propose, we should be glad to consider it. Hmm. Oh, here's our mom. And the child. Her last child, most likely. But why is she here? What is the meaning of this, Lord Kupka? What it means is that I am disinclined to advise you any longer. She sort of still looks the same. A little older. She still looks the same after like 18 years. Ah, the looks on their faces when you walked through those doors. A perfect picture of stupefaction. They could not believe their eyes. She actually looks the same. Though I confess, I had my own doubts whether or not you would accept my invitation. Such shocking news. Sid isn't a son of a whore. He's the son of an empress. Your own dear Clive. Absurd. Who fed you these lies? I have never spent a moment among criminals, save at the gallows. I came here with my son, not to entertain your baseless accusations, but to put an end to the senseless hostilities between our nations. Very well. You need only agree to the terms I set out. Sid took the life of someone dear to me. A woman by the name of Benedicta. I swore to take his in turn. 
This would not be disagreeable to you, I take it. You would finally be rid of the stain on your noble name. In return, I will leave Sandbrek in your capable hands. Your Imperial Majesty. I thought they were gonna have an affair. And all for the love of a common whore. <laughs> Dominant or no, one cannot hide one's breeding. And beasts will ever belong with beasts. <laughs> Man, something is horrible. Why she got her id? There are greater things in store for you, my darling Olivier. Olivier. Soon enough, you shall be the crown prince of Sambrek. And when your father goes to meet great Grieger, wow. you shall be emperor of all wow. you survey. The old order shall come tumbling down, and you will rebuild the world in your glorious image. <laughs> Soon. Oh. Okay. First, I'm guessing her son is a dominant too, but of who? Just no, can't be. I don't know. We'll see. She's been in there for hours. Something must be wrong. After the storm. I was going to say, before all the cutscenes, this game has... Party makeup has changed. This game has... Um, they put a lot into the, the M-rated part of the game, but not they didn't go too far. They Sometimes they have beheadings, but you don't really see like the actual beheading. Like You see the head or the... You don't really see the body you just see the head sometimes only in the beginning of the game or like the from the P the pov of the person that got their head cut off or whatever but I don't, that's only happened a couple times but they do stabbings and stuff like actual killing yeah but they don't really go too far with the the m rated in this game uh, but that's gonna be it for my stream tonight uh, i'm gonna play more of this right now offline uh Maybe I'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, I feel. But it was a good stream tonight. I appreciate everybody for stopping by. And you guys have a good one.